Well, a D.C. father and business owner is dead tonight. Alexander Mosby was gunned down early this morning near Savannah Terrace and 23rd Street in Southeast. WUSA 9's Michael Quander just got back from the neighborhood, and Michael, he said you spoke with one of his friends. Yeah, Deborah, and they were devastated tonight. People who knew Alexander Mosby say he was the guy who seemed to be doing everything right. Someone they never thought would be D.C.'s latest victim of gun violence. It doesn't look good as it is. So now we even looking worse. After so many years of people being killed in his community, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ronald Moulton learned to be strong. I actually got numb to cry because I've seen so many homicides. But when it happened to his friend, Alexander Mosby, he was like a brother to me, like generally like a brother. Things were different. We're gonna miss you. And I just love you as a brother for everything that you are. It was hard to hold back the tears. Everything you did for us. After learning Mosby was shot to death just before two o'clock Saturday morning. It was right here on Savannah Terrace in Southeast. This guy doing it right and play all the moves right on the chessboard and still get killed. The family man, also known as Bundy, had a wife and three kids. He was also a business owner. A flower now sits outside of his store called District Culture in Anacostia. It was being transformed into a lounge. I mean, this is a sad day. This is a very, this is a very sad day. Loved ones say Mosby loved being from Southeast and helping people in his neighborhood. He was at an event last night celebrating D.C. natives just hours before he was killed. He was just the type of person that always was there for his community, and that's rare today. Yeah, and police don't know why Mosby was killed or who pulled the trigger. The person who did this is still out there on the streets.